Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Aries. It is a general reading. That being said, it may or may not resonate with you. If it doesn't sound like it's your story, check your other placements. Your messages could be there for you, Aries. I feel like you may have hit a brick wall when it comes to your relationship. You may have taken a fall. Um, I, it feels like um, <clears throat> you're grieving over this, okay? Um, maybe somebody went too far. Uh, with the assassin in the reverse. Um, the painter um, is about solutions for change. Okay, so there's something here that you really want to change because you know you need to. Uh, this whole situation uh, is uh, frustrating you. Um, you're not happy. Uh, it indicates... Um, that you are possibly living in an unhappy situation, um, life in general, uh, or it's life in general, you know. Um, you may have with the painter, um, you may have painted a picture for someone. So you may have given somebody uh, a wake-up call, possibly. You may have painted the picture of how this relationship is and where it stands right now. You may have, have uh, given somebody a wake-up call, possibly, with this. It could be that somebody went too far with you and it's like the final nail in the coffin. And so you may have uh, possibly... Uh, given this person like an ultimatum even. The waker over here is about um, awareness, reflection. So you may be reflecting on how you, are, how you can cope with this or maybe even um, how you could regroup, you know. Um, <clears throat> Right now, it's important to practice awareness of your surroundings. The current events and the lives of those around you, close to you, can be overwhelming in the moment with, with, the, with this card being here, okay? But you're only ever seeing part of the story, it says. The ability to think uh, critically and ask key questions is an important skill, so this card would ask you to be perceptive about the situations happening around you and trust your own gut before acting. Your inner and outer, uh, outer the inner and outer events are connected. Okay, um, there's some very t intense energy here because uh, we have fire and we have fire. Okay, now. Um, See, you're trying to figure this out. You don't know what to do. Uh, you're in the hangman energy here with this situation. You're trying to get back on your feet, um, trying to figure out how you're going to uh, get through this. These are coping skills, okay? Um, you may be doubting in them. Um, the Andra, well, you could be... Okay, so you're longing for change and this feels, uh, what you desire may feel at this point where you are uh, out of reach, you know. And so it's like um, you're trying to see, uh, you're trying to look at your situation in a new way uh, that, um, or look at something in a new way that could change your situation. You're looking for new solutions, a new way, because the old way isn't working. You keep hitting brick walls, okay? So it's like, how can I fix things? How can I make things better? How can I get my desired outcome, okay? And um, for that, uh, here, there is reflection on the past or a need to reflect on the past, okay, with this card. Because here you've tried to work with somebody, but you end up alone. You ended up alone. You ended up that there was no compromise, right? Uh, the tools that you were working with got thrown on the bench because they weren't working for you, you know. 
you may feel like you didn't get your wish. Um, the Melaramantam is weighing things up. This is what you are doing um, in order to find your way through this energy. Um, it it requires uh, it requires us to be honest with ourselves, with uh, honest with our issues, and that we acknowledge the truth of our lives and act accordingly. This is crucial. Otherwise it turns in the reverse okay so currently it is in the upright um, this is about somebody could be being very stubborn uh, about uh, an opportunity or about some information about maybe an offer or something that is being offered here especially that the ace of wisdom is showing up next to it so there there's likely uh, you take a fall, but there's a new opportunity that is that comes back around uh, or that comes out of this somehow. Um, you you could be very troubled. Um, you could be thinking that maybe you're deceiving yourself to think that you could reach this goal with this person. That's a possibility. But it's like uh, your heart wants this. Your heart wants to go back. Your heart wants to find the solutions, okay? The problem is that there are ghosts of the past hanging around here. And that's actually the reason why you keep hitting brick walls. It is the ghosts of the past. They're appearing here, and they're appearing here, and here. So um, those those are the reasons why you're hitting brick walls. And so if you want to, uh, in, in order to take a new path, okay, the new path is you need to deal with the ghosts of the past. You need to turn around and face them. You need to, if, if, if these ghosts are lying between you and your partner, then you need to put them on the table. And uh, they need to be open for discussion. If you, you know, that would be the new path. That would be the good path. That would be the way forward, I believe, for you um, to save this relationship. There's a decision for the future that you need to make that you're grieving over. This is you because this is the sign of Aries. And it has to do with a direction. What direction are you going to take? And I, I feel like, I feel like, look, look, look who's here, okay? This person, uh, there's still a very strong romantic connection between you two. So um, I still think, oh my God, look at this. <laughs> oh my God, look at this. There's the love card and a new beginning, okay? So, I mean, it's that is still there. there there's ghosts of the past hanging around here interfering with this relationship and causing all of this chaos and those need to be dealt with because the love is still here and this relationship can still be saved because of the love it's possible that somebody was not ready to uh, um, to to do this in the past, and, uh, but I feel like you're at the point where uh, where you will be ready because this card suggests that although they were not ready at the time um, to move this forward, that's why it didn't work, or to to deal with the ghosts of the past, to talk about the ghosts of the past, they weren't ready to do that. That's why you hit this brick wall again. Um, but that doesn't, this card suggests that they might be ready to do this in the future here, okay, and, uh, and here they are doing it, okay, so here they are, uh, they are going to do this. You must both do this in order for it to work. Um, all the things that are troubling you and that are eating away at you, all of those little uh, frustrations that you have been letting pile up and pile up and pile up until you've got this big mess, they need to uh, 
uh, they need to um, uh, come out onto the table. You need to face them. You need to face these little frustrations, these fears, and you need to clear these up, okay? Um, and if this is not you, then this is the other person. This can also be a card of guilt. It could be a card of secret, somebody holding on to a secret or somebody else's secret even, okay? And, um, and this has been eating at them. It's time for this to come out. Now, this person... Um, we begin with this hangman down here who's defeated. They don't know what to do. But then we progress up to this hangman who now has received some sort of understanding about their situation and they now know what they must do in order to save this relationship. Okay? They now know what they must do. And what they must do is to um, have this conversation. He's about negotiation, talking to somebody. Look at that. <laughs> Knight of Cups. Okay, this will bring change. We have the change card coming up next. This will bring change to the relationship and like in a huge way. You know, you can't... Um, if you follow the same path over and over and over again, you, you can't, you know, you're going to get the same result. What you're going to do here is take a new path. Okay. And, and this is why, uh, it will change. You're going to lay all these ghosts out onto the table to be discussed and addressed so that you can move forward with this person that you love. And I know that they love you also. Okay. I know this because of this and this. So you need to get cracking, this next card is saying, and get moving with this. So, so that's what I have for you. I mean, this is what you need to do. This is, I'm telling you why it wasn't working and what you need to do to make it work. So, the waker, it's time to wake up. It's time to become aware. It's very, very important to practice awareness of your surroundings. Current events and the lives of those around you or, or the people that are close to you can be overwhelming, but you're only ever seeing part of the story. What you need to see is the whole story. The whole story is not clear until you lay those ghosts out onto the table. Then you've got the whole story. The ability to think critically and ask key questions is an important skill. Don't forget that. Be perceptive about the situations happening around you and trust your own gut before acting, before speaking. And remember, you know, this, this is what this card is saying. Remember, inner and outer events are connected. The inner and outer events are connected. There's the inner events. There they are. Okay. And uh, the outer events. This is what happened. Okay. That's the fall caused by these inner events. That's why this, uh, this, didn't work. It's why it never, uh, it never worked. Even though it may have gotten to the other shore, it failed to work. It failed to work. Why? Because of all the ghostly passengers that were aboard that ship. <laughs> they were all there. That's why. Inner and outer events are connected. Look behind you and you shall find them. That is what I have for you. I thank you for watching. 
for liking and for sharing my videos and for uh, subscribing. Also, thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation. It is greatly appreciated. Many blessings to all of you.